let's begin the session apache active mq before going to apache active mq i will give you some clarity about jms okay then only it will easy for you for understanding apache active mq so jms stands for java message service assume there is a application which is available in india there is b application which is available in uk or usa some other country and between these two applications how the data is transferred one application to other application that mean exchanging of messages between two software components how it will happen by using jms we can achieve this one okay this is the context we are going to using jms and it will handle producer consumer problem here producer means create the messages and sending consumer means here receive the messages from producer and jms supports loose coupling right loose coupling means what sir flexibility it will provide okay without code changes in the future we are going to adding some extra features without disturbing existing code this context we can say loose coupling in the market there are number of jms service providers available okay for easy manner in order to developing jms applications we need jms service provider okay for that purpose we have different different vendors and those vendors providing jms service provider okay in the market we have apache active mq ibm mq and rabbit mq open jms we have number of service providers available in the market okay these jms service providers can manage the sessions can manage the queues can manage the topics right these jms providers if you use we can easily develop the jms applications so some of the terminology and its duties if you know then we can easily develop application first one is mom message oriented middleware what it will do exactly sending and receiving messages between distributed systems here distributed means sir in different different locations okay you are going to sending and receiving messages right across the world assume right so we can say it is distributed right so what will support sir sending and receiving messages between distributed systems the next one is client we can say client is an application that produces and receive messages 
right an application a client is an application that produces messages and receives the messages okay and next one is producer or publisher client that creates and sends messages client will create messages and sends messages this is nothing but what sir producer or publisher and the next one is consumer or subscriber client that receive the messages we can say consumer or subscriber this is message message is nothing but what sir normal uh, just messages right between two application how data transferred right you can assume so those messages transferred between clients that is nothing but message context okay the data is being transferred between two clients assume okay and the next one is queue so queue what it will do sir exactly it's hold client messages right queue is established for what sir to hold client messages and queue is used for especially only for point to point communication okay that means sending message to only one consumer sir here so we can say this context as point to point communication next one is topic sir here topic is nothing but messages are delivered to multiple subscribers not for single subscribers sir here this topic is used for especially publish and subscribe we can say pub or sub model right see in this pub or sub model multiple subscribers will involve fine see this is point to point communication and we can observe apache active mq work as mom this apache active mq is a service provider and work as message oriented middleware see we have one producer and we have also one consumer okay producer will create the messages that means produce the messages and sending message right and this apache active mq is involved right instead this apache active mq there is q concept pictureized right we already discussed what is exactly this q q will hold the messages q will hold the messages from this producer producer will produce the messages that means create the messages and sending those messages right and q will hold messages right and consumer will consume the messages where from the this consumer will consume the messages from this queue right and this queue is nothing but where it is getting from producer so 
consumer will consume the messages from this queue right so consumer will receive the message from where from this queue only so producer will produce the messages that means create the messages and sending messages right and uh, apache active mq working as message oriented middleware and in in this uh, message oriented middleware there is a concept queue queue will hold the messages from this producer and finally co consumer will consume the messages that means receive the messages from this queue this is nothing but what sir point to point communication fine the next topic is what sir publish and subscribe and here also we have one publisher and publisher will publish the messages okay and uh, apache active mq working as message oriented middleware and uh, in this message oriented middleware one topic will involve right this topic is nothing but whatever publishing these messages it will hold messages right and whatever publishes messages uh, will receive subscribers these subscribers in order to receive these messages based on the interest on specific topic so we can say this is publish and subscribe so that's all i hope you understand apache active mq a basic concept this is Jay signing off. Bye-bye.